Good morning. Today is a great day. Today is a beautiful day. Today is an amazing day. Today is going to be a good day. Hmm. So, you think you woke yourself up this morning? You think you got your own self to work this morning? You think you woke up in your right mind today? You think you did that? I can't believe you think that. Guys, if you thought that you woke yourself up and you did all the things by yourself, I beg to differ. Guys, we can never do nothing alone. Thanks to the Father, thanks to God, your Lord, your Creator, your universe, or whoever and whatever you believe in. That's who helps you get up. That is what speaks to you and say, okay, it's time to move these legs. It's time to move these hands. It's time to move these, um, this mouth. It is time to let these eyes work today. You cannot do nothing without him. Nothing you can do without him. So please, y'all, you did not get yourself up this morning. Yeah, you did not do it alone. You did it with help from the Most High. See you. to another day, to another episode of Day in the Life with Simply Natural Black Life. Yeah, guys. So um, today is a beautiful day. The sun is out. Um, it doesn't get no better than that. It's, we still have snow here, but it is really um, beautiful to look at the sun. Um, it does look like clouds, though. I'm not sure what's going to happen, but I do, I do plan on walking today. I'm going to make that my business to walk today. So guys, I'm going to... I'm gonna have my um, green juice that I made yesterday. That's gonna be my morning. Um, I'm gonna start off with my morning kick today with my vitamins and I have some fly fit protein mix nuts here. I'm gonna have those, I'm just gonna put those in my cart. But today guys, I'm gonna go to, I'll tell you the two places that I'm going to. I'm gonna try to hit up Walmart. I'm gonna try to go and get, we was just there. I wish I would have known that, I mean, well we didn't know as far as that TV situation is. So I could have got, um, okay, the thing is, y'all, we need a mount for the TV for the bedroom. So I'm, if I'm in the area over there I'm, where I'm going to go today to go look for flower pots, I'm going to go to World Market, and then there's a Marshalls across the, like, across the parking lot from there. I think I'm going to go to Marshalls first, then go to the World Market and see what kind of flower pots they got. Hopefully I can find two or one, um, we'll give or take. And then um, if I have enough time, I'm gonna go to Walmart and pick up the uh, wall mount for the 50 inch screen TV. Guys, we got it, that was a really good deal because at Walmart, they wanted um, 218, but it was, we was gonna get a 43 inch. We got a 50 inch for 269. We saved $54 because I do have a, a BJ's uh, thing there and I forgot all about it. Um, so they did say we say $54 and plus this is like the 4k. So I don't know what that is. If y'all know what that is, then y'all know what I'm talking about. Basically it's like the picture and stuff. And then I got, let me share something with y'all. The guy at Walmart, y'all know what he told us? He told us that, cause Mark asked him, he said, Ooh, these pictures, these TVs, look, everything looks clear. He said, uh, uh, he said, there's a plug that Walmart, Walmart uses, use that makes the TV look crystal clear on all these TVs. He said, but the TVs do not be like that. Mm-hmm. Y'all, this is good. This is really good. Yeah, he actually said that's what Walmart does. So, for all of y'all, now y'all know, the TVs and pictures are not that clear. They have a special device and that's probably at all places unless it's a better price, a better uh, quality TV. So I'm kind of glad we went with a Philips TV uh, 4K because it has like a, a lot of extra stuff that Roku does not have. It has Roku on it, but it has like different other extra features. We do that TV just in the back room is a Roku. So I am planning on myself. I'm probably going to, he probably going to do it with me. Get a 43 for that other room because I just, I really feel like that TV is too small. But a person would have to 
be in there. It, somebody might say it's not too small. So I'm not sure. I just wanted a bigger TV in there. So guys, that is my plans for right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and get ready to warm up my truck and we're gonna go get started. And if I can bring you guys along for some, I will do so. Yes, she's still enjoying her space in the kitchen. Y'all, I love being here. I like watching stuff on my phone in here. I like sitting at the table reading. Um, I just like sitting in here. And that's what a kitchen is for, is to sit in. If you can't sit in your kitchen and only cook, I, I just don't see the purpose. I don't wanna just cook in here. I wanna sit down and enjoy my meals with my friends and my family. And um, yeah, that's it, y'all. That's it, I'll see y'all. I'll see y'all um, momentarily, okay? All right, y'all, we're rolling. It's not too bad outside. It's a little windy, though. It might feel like 40 degrees or something. But um, it's very windy. And y'all know what? I went to the gas station. I usually just go to Shell, but I went to Speedway. I haven't been there in so long. Because my other my other car, I used to always go to Shell because they had, like, that flex field. But today I went there, and I, the gas has went up, y'all. What are they doing? How's y'all going up on the gas like that? It's almost three dollars again. Like, uh-uh, I don't like that. But I stopped and got me some coffee from the gas station, which I have not done. Oh my God, y'all, it's been years, but it's pretty good. I got some Colombian roast, but they didn't have their um, they didn't have their stuff set up really, really good. It was like you had to go looking around for cup tops, and I was, I didn't like that. But the coffee tastes pretty good. Gas station coffee. Here y'all, toast to y'all. <laughs> so we're on our way. I'll bring you guys to um, Marshall's and um, World Marketplace, I think it is, okay? Oh y'all, look at that. They have several. Look at that one, I like that. And then they even have, they even have like the stand like that with, with, with marble on it. So, we'll see what we're gonna get. They don't have much though. I really would like um, a taller one. I'm trying to think. I think they're they're tall with um, they're tall like with metal things on them. So yeah, we'll keep looking. Now this is uh, Marshall with Marshall Pass. This is uh, then they have those. I don't like those. Let's go back here and see. I don't know y'all. I think World Market maybe have better. Because these are, these are, uh, what is that, $20. So we'll see. I did decide to stop in Goodwill to see if they had any any flower pots because I was passing one. But let me show you what I'm, what I'm going to get, what I found. Look at this, look at this candle. Can y'all see that? White locust. It's only a dollar nine cents. It's by, what is this? Lab. Barely lit. I'm going to get that. And it's a glass container in the metal um, metal top. So yeah, that's a plus. All right, y'all. I stopped at Walmart and I got um, I got plant dirt. I got I found me a flower pot and a um, hanging TV thing for thirty-two to seven, which is a great deal. So this this is the flower pot that I got. It's a stand and it's metal. I love that. They only have one, and it's uh, fourteen ninety-seven. I think it's like three dollars and some change. Guys, look at this. This was only 20, it's 19.99. And I got some um, incense. So yeah, I'm glad I stopped over here. I went to Target and some other places. They didn't have nothing. So um, this was for the win. I'll see you when I get home. All right guys, I'm finally home. So really quick, I'm gonna make this video, okay? Cause I'm gonna show y'all what I got from uh, Walmart, um, Goodwill. I went to all these too to get some, a few groceries, but I'm not gonna really like get into that because that's more like a, it's a really, really small stuff, so I don't wanna um, get into that. But I'm gonna show y'all the big old monstrosity TV right now in the bedroom. So I can't wait till he can hang this up. And then I'll probably show y'all tomorrow what it looked like tomorrow. So here is the TV. It's still doing, I wanted to show y'all without it. Um, let me see if I can go over here. It just seems so super bright, but that's how big this TV is, y'all. If y'all guys can see that. It's super, super, super duper big. It's so sunny here. So that's probably why you really can't um, get it. But that's where it is now. And I came up with a solution and an idea. Um, I don't need two flower pots. I'm gonna show you guys why, cause, hold on a second. Let me turn, um, let me get this out of here. But remember in here, 
in the bathroom remember this flower pot this is actually a flower pot that i painted and guys see if you just if you just like use your imagination so what i'm gonna do is let me turn this light off i'm gonna take this these bulb things I, these are a little uh i forgot what you but face filler i'm gonna take these out and this is gonna be my other flower pot for my plant there so i already got that um taken care of and then i'll just show y'all real quick what i got from walmart okay and then i'm gonna end this video so i can get it to y'all okay so this is the flower pot i bought 13 dollars. i like it and this is the only one they had i like it because it's very mid-century modern it has a drainage hole right here and it sits up off the floor at um i couldn't find um marketplace they're closed they're they're not there anymore so i don't know where they went and i wasn't gonna keep searching I went to Marshall's, you guys, saying they didn't have number 20 for stuff for $20, and they're too low to the floor. So I got this. I picked up uh, this from Walmart. I think I was trying to show y'all. And this was only $20. I'm so glad. Um, 20 bucks. This holds up 32 to 70 So just in case if we ever upgrade or something, we'll have it. I got another bag of potting soil mix. I got um, some things for to make my candles. If you guys don't know, if you're new here, I make my own candles, and I will sell them. Um, so I got some wicks here, and then I picked up some um, patchouli incense, and I got this candle, guys. So pretty. I got this candle from Goodwill for a dollar and nine cents. It's really, really pretty, y'all. And the can, the top is metal, and this is glass, so I can use this for something else, another candle or whatever. Um, I also, I can show y'all real quick. I also picked up some stuff from Audis. This we didn't have any more spinach. I got some arugula and spinach. Um, I don't know why the thing is, our power must have went out when I was gone all day. Orange juice, cookies, tomatoes, cucumber, some raisin bread, mushrooms, and chips, guys. That's it. So, that is going to end it today for this video. I'm going to try to get this uploaded right now and get sent to y'all. Um, let me know what part of the video you enjoyed. Did you like hanging out with me today? And guys, I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget, love yourself so that you'll love others so this world will be a much better place. Um, no, Mark is not here yet. It is like 5 o'clock. And we've both been gone since this morning. So, um, yeah, he was supposed to be going to paint um, a house and stuff and then go help our son with another house. So, yeah, I'll see you guys. Remember, love, peace, and joy, and wellness. Bye, y'all.